What's up, guys? Angelo Mangabe here with another. Well, not with another. That was on my other account, but with a review on a BB gun. And that BB gun is the Colt Defender BB gun. And yes, of course, it is CO2. But let's get started. Okay, so one of the main features is it's all metal. Nothing on here is plastic except for the safety and the grip right here. And this right here, this is not metal. That's um a sticker. People get excited about that. I don't know why. But at least you can't pull it off. It looks real and it looks like metal. So, as you guys can see. And this gun... Is really good. It's around 440, 430 FPS. I mean, it can shoot through my closet, closet, and there's a thing right here where you can put a laser, a flashlight, whatever you like. But the ain't the sight. Good, everything good. The only bad thing is that you can shoot something at you. It'll go through your skin. And it'll do some pretty good damage, or it can shoot your eye, and you'll be blind for the rest of your life. You shoot a tooth, that's coming out. Nail, that's going to be bleeding. Basically, everything that you shoot is going to be bleeding. Let's just make it down to that. And this comes off like that if you press, like you're taking your clip off. CO2, you know how to put CO2 in. BBs, you pull this down. All the way to the left, and then you enter your BBs in that little slot right there. And you push that to the right a little, and it goes up. And you push this back, and you're good to fire. Except you need to take it off safety. And this can also come off, but you can put it back on too. And yeah, this is molded in. The thing that takes apart the gun is fake and molded in. The hammer is molded in, and the safety is molded in. Well, let's go back there. And it fires good too. I might do a firing test later on. And trigger is really easy to pull once. Well, if you're weak, then no, it's not easy to pull. But if you, if you're good at pulling, <laughs> that sounds wrong. But if you're good at pulling things out and stuff, then or if you're strong, that's easy to pull. But I'm just not going to fire it right now. And if you're going to blink fire, make sure there's no BBs in there before you fire it. And put like something hard in front of it that you don't care about. It doesn't have to be hard, but something that you don't care about in front of what you're blink firing at. So you don't mess anything up. Because I already shot my closet and it went right through. And it's wooden. But I'll do a review on my other gun. It's a zombie dropper from Walmart. This gun is also from Walmart, I think. Or Big Five. But the only bad thing about it is that the warning, this, and the it tells you what BBs it takes. Oh, yeah, the BBs. 0.177, 4.5mm BBs. And the ones I use are Copperhead. These, this little thing right here. It holds 1,500 BBs, and the, there's some that are like two times the size of this that holds 6,000 BBs, so I would recommend getting that one, just because it holds more, you know, the more the better, but yeah, and I'm trying to make this video short, because I'm going to the Warriors game, but that was my review, and like, comment, share, subscribe, and thanks guys.